I'm nervous. My, why am I so nervous? My heart is beating all fast. Halle Bailey was feeling a little more antsy than angelic at about 8.50 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on Thursday night, 10 minutes before her solo debut with hit streaming services. So, um, yeah. one more minute. Okay, it is Woo! 9 o'clock. Do you still swim in your thoughts? Yeah, Halle revealed on Instagram Live that swimming onto the big screen as Ariel in the live action version of Little Mermaid, which hit theaters in May, was certainly a different experience for the Grammy nominee. It's just been like this really eye-opening experience the last few years of my life, right? I have been living in actress world for a minute. I wanna see, wanna see I'm dancing. All of a sudden, I was thrown into this world of so many different opinions and what people thought of me and was I good for this role? Well, Holly says she's extremely grateful for the Disney experience. The 23 year old also says that having all those voices and critics be part of her world as she was trying to film and promote the movie was overwhelming. This song for me was my kind of, I guess affirmations that I would tell myself to keep myself being able to keep going. Now Hallie hopes that the song can go beyond just being a personal pick-me-up and become an anthem for others. But it's definitely, uh, for sure, a black girl anthem. Black girl here, black girl with the black girl here. For all my black girlies, all my black girlies, because I'm sorry, but we just, we be needing some love. Some some encouragement. Giving Hallie some encouragement was her sister, Chloe. Yay! Angel, 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 angel. <laughs> Woo! Yay! Woo! I'm so excited. Everybody better be streaming Angel tonight. You guys are gonna love it. It's amazing. <laughs> yeah, Chloe dropped in on the Instagram live about five minutes before the song was released. I think she was just as excited, or if not more excited, <laughs> than Hallie for the song to drop. Woo! I'm very nervous. Woo! I'm very excited. I've never done this before. Woo! Okay, guys. <laughs> Eight minutes after midnight, Chloe tweeted, That's my mother beeping angel. Hallie, I'm so damn proud. I'm in tears. And once the song did drop, Hallie was not in the mood to hear from haters. I hope you guys like it. Um, and if you don't, just don't say nothing. <laughs> But as Hallie got some shut-eye, the glowing reactions started to come in. On her Instagram post promoting the song's release, Yara Shahidi commented, Full body chills. Leanne Pinnock was wowed. Lauren Haregi used the crying emoji saying it was so beautiful, which Seven echoed. Amber Riley thought the song was ethereal. When Hallie woke up at about 9.30 a.m., she learned that the song was top 10 on iTunes. She tweeted she thought that was so cool. Soon to be live action Snow White, Rachel Zegler quoted Hallie's tweet and wrote, the most deserving angel princess. By Friday afternoon, Hallie started Instagramming all the support she was getting from the streaming services, including Apple Music, Spotify, Amazon Music, and Billboard showcasing it on their Friday Music Guide. Well, it's all paying off, because by 2.30 Pacific Standard Time, Hallie Instagrammed that the song had reached number one on iTunes and was the number two music video. As the video zoomed past one million views on YouTube, Hallie wrote at 3.43 p.m. Pacific Time, you guys have gotten the video to one million in less than 24 hours and given me my first number one on iTunes R&B. Seriously, so thankful. Love you guys, keep streaming. And now about seven hours later, the video is closing in on two million views and is number 18 in YouTube trending. So the song is off to a great start as people are curious to hear Hallie's solo sound. Chloe's first solo venture was Have Mercy, which came out in September 2021 and has racked up 102 million views since. I don't think that's necessarily the bar that Hallie has to hit, but at least gives you an indication of the potential audience for Hallie that's out there. I just love the fact that I am um, starting off with this as just an anthem and a love letter to all of y'all. She certainly is a high profile coming off The Little Mermaid, and the fact that the inspiration for Angel is tied to that movie certainly helps things. But yeah, what do you think of Angel on its own? Like, there's no doubt that Hallie's vocals are incredible on this. She's reaching into the heavens on some of those high notes. Whoa! It's a beautiful song. Um, I don't think it has a strong refrain. And especially, I find it a little awkward, the one part where it's kind of coming down on the scale. So I'm not sure how radio friendly this is or how many people, after being curious to hear Hallie's solo sound, are going to be hitting repeat on the song. But I do think it's a quality piece of music. I'm just not sure it's the greatest um, 
for a single for her. Because reality is, look, she wants to get airplay. She wants that song to become a hit, right? A pop hit. Um, I don't think this will do it for her. What do you think? 